Hello everyone, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for January 27th, 2019. Got a lot of things moving and shaking over the past few days. <laughs> Let's see what is coming up for us today. Oh, and the sun just shifted. It got really dark. Okay, I'll fix it in post. <laughs> Goodness me. All right, let's see what we have here. I'm hearing the word retreating. This might be a day of retreating and just contemplating and resting a little bit. But let's see what the card says. All right. So we have Oceana. Take action. You're in touch with your truth in this situation and you need to trust your gut and lovingly assert yourself. And what they're saying is, is that retreating on this day is to figure out how you want to take action. Now, this whole card in Oceana, the ocean, water, emotions, it's all about that. So you see she's doing like a little deep dive there in the ocean. And this is just, again, it's more of the same where it's like you're getting in touch with how you feel. Um, what is it that you really, really want? And so part of the taking action is starting in silence. It's starting in stillness. It's saying, stop the chaos. Everybody freeze. I got to think about this, <laughs> right? Or I got to feel this out or I want to meditate upon this. Okay. That's you taking action. Often people will you know, see this card and sometimes in a card reading, it depends on the person, but, um, they, they think that it means take outward action, get moving, force it, you know, take, uh, you know, take the bull by the horns kind of thing. And for today, that's not really what we're talking about. Taking action, uh, really means taking stock, looking at where you have been, where are you now, where do you want to head? It really is emotionally centered. So work on the heart chakra, of course, but also the sacral chakra. The sacral chakra has a lot of overlap with some of the other chakras that people aren't even aware of. And this is the emotional body, okay? You also obviously feel with your heart, but you feel with your gut as well, right? And this might, you know, speaking of the gut, <laughs> might be talking a little bit about self-esteem issues. Do you constantly feel alone? Do you constantly feel invisible? And I'm not talking about people who need constant attention and somebody for once just doesn't give you attention. And you're like, oh my gosh, you're treating me so badly. We're talking about people who never really have their moment in the sun. We, we're talking about people who they work hard, they're generating ideas, they're generating beauty in this world, and they don't get credit for it. Yes. And often we talk about, you know, don't run your life doing things and making choices based on how you can get rewarded. And yet there needs to be a sense of equal exchange, energy for energy. Okay. So if you, let's say you're in a job and you put a lot of energy into it and you're just taken for granted and you're not compensated, maybe you're getting into debt and you're thinking, oh my gosh, you know, how am I going to get out of this? Or maybe it's in a relationship where it's a one-sided street and that can be, you know, a, you know, one-on-one -on -one with a friend as well. You know, somebody who's just constantly taking advantage. This is the day where you take action to sit and get clarity. Okay. You can work with Archangel Michael with this. You can work with Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Raphael. So take that into consideration. There are a few of you out there that besides that major message, <laughs> you might actually have to be like, okay, I have to make a decision. Okay. I have to figure out what do I want to do next, which is what a lot of these past few cards have been telling us to do. All right. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.